What's going on fish nerds? It's been a little while since I've shown the turtle pond and you guys have been asking for an update on the turtles. So that's what I've got for you today. And if you stick around to the end, I am gonna feed them as well. So let's get started. So here's the turtle pond, still sitting in the same spot. A few updates to it. Uh, since the last time I really focused on the turtle pond, I did build this basking dock and uh, it's a relatively simple design. I just uh, took the two sheets of plywood and join them together with that two by four and uh, it's just another two by four back here resting on the edge with another piece of plywood to keep it from tipping in and the uh, bottom of this dock is actually resting on the uh, the bulkhead itself and uh, all this water is actually not from soaking up what's in the tank because it's not touching the water this is actually from them climbing up there and the, the water settling on that and it's not re really drying out like I would like. So I do plan on actually redoing this. I will keep the back on here just so that when they're, the whatever other basking dock is there, one, they can't climb out because they, they've got a wall here and two, it's still something to keep the, the basking light mounted onto. But I'm thinking I'm just gonna take the bottom part off and uh, actually build something with egg crate and uh, probably cover the egg crate with this window screen as well just to one make it prettier and two to keep their feet from slipping through the egg crate but these guys are all doing really well they're growing a lot they're a lot bigger than the last time you saw them I don't know if you can really tell from video how much larger they are but these guys were about two inches across in shell length when I first got them. And uh, certainly bigger than that now. So yeah, until they're large enough for me to know whether or not there's any females in here, we're just calling them after the Ninja Turtles, Leonardo, Raphael, Donatello, and Michelangelo. And then once uh, we find out whether or not there's any girls in here, we will reevaluate and uh, do some renaming accordingly. And of course, they are big fans of the Ninja Turtles, so they got their fan art up here. So the filtration on this tank is still the DIY trickle sump filter over here. Just overflows, runs down this PVC pipe, down into the top of the trickle filter and uh, I need to change out the mechanical media here, which is why this bin is chock full of water. Big mess. You can see that's all clogged up. And I'm thinking this is like 15 micron filter media. And uh, that's, I'm thinking that's just too small to be working with turtles. Uh, because the waste the turtles put off is big enough and all of that that just it clogs up way too fast and then of course just got our our pot scrubbies the scouring pads the plastic ones from the dollar store all in this drawer and then the drawer that's down here on the bottom that's actually completely underwater is full of uh, lava rock crushed lava rock it cracks me up that when I come up here, especially if I haven't fed them yet that day, if I come up here, they'll just climb all over each other trying to, to get out in front because they're expecting to be fed. And you may remember that I was using these little tubs to feed the turtles in just to get them all separated from each other so that they don't have food aggression issues or outcompete each other for food, that kind of a thing. But, uh, these got to be a little too small and I had actually left them in here and went inside the house uh, for a little bit and came out a few minutes later and one of the turtles had actually escaped and was somewhere loose out here in the garage and kind of had a little panic attack. Found them pretty quickly but still gave me a bit of a panic attack so I'm not using these anymore and I have started using these which are much bigger but unfortunately I only have two of these. I still need to get to the store and get two more because right now I can only feed two turtles at a time using this, but uh, this is what I'm using.
All right, guys, so that's what I've got for you today. Just a quick update on the turtles. And if you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think. And if you're new here and you like turtles, and especially if you like fish, make sure you subscribe because I'm putting out new videos every single week. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching. You're awesome. God bless you, fish nerds. I'll see you next time.